Nine degrees. <laughs> Ten degrees. Oh. Eleven degrees. Shut your face. <laughs> we don't often get a view from an RV site like this one. Look at that. That's pretty cool, huh? Yeah. We are going to hit a section of the Blue Ridge Parkway we've never been on before. Right. I just love this kind of ride because there's no intersections, there's no stoplights. Wow, you guys, the views here on this side of the parkway are amazing. Oh, son of a gun. You guys, look at that. Who knew all of this was up here? This is awesome. We really enjoyed our stay here. But to give you a pro tip on this particular location, I would park anywhere but where we did, simply because you see our bedroom window is right there and the big AC unit for the barn or whatever is right there. So that was right outside our window all night. Not real loud, but being right outside our window is a little bit noisy. I would park a little bit further back or pretty much anywhere except for where we parked. I've been looking forward to this campground for a long time. Mm -hmm. Where we're headed next. Mama Gertie's in Asheville. It's the same owners as one of our favorite campgrounds ever, the Great Outdoors in Franklin. Mm -hmm. We have not been to Mama Gertie's before, but when we looked at all the reviews and stuff, I noticed that a lot of people were saying, oh, our RV's too long to go up the main road. It's a, apparently a steep incline. So I let Chad know, and then when he was talking to the manager there, we decided that when we get there, we're gonna just pull over and park and take their like golf cart or four-wheeler up just to check it out. Always do a scouting run if you're not sure, mm. absolutely. And man, I hope that we do because our site is one of the best sites there. Yeah, this place is literally built into the side of a mountain. We're about 78 miles away. See you there. Wish us luck. Hmm. Can you feel it? There's something in the air, sensei. Right up my ass, isn't he? Yeah. We're real smart. Yeah, I wouldn't even know he's back here without the camera. Yep, in this kind of weather, too. I love you too. Mm -hmm. Take exit 59 on the right towards Swaganoa, then take the first left. Turn left at the stop sign. Sharp curve, half mile ahead. Oh, jeez Louise. Chad, Let's look at burn. this road. This road looks really scary all of a sudden. Oh, no. In one half mile, arrive at Mama Gertie's Hideaway Campground on the left. I mean, I guess other campers do too. Yeah. It's a little narrow. Yeah. You're not even going to fit in that lane. <laughs> then there's like parked in the road. But you parked there. Oh no. Where I should go, but I won't worry. Accelerating. Let's see what we got here. We're at nine degrees. I am not a fan of this road, and we're not even on the road that was worrying me. I didn't know <laughs> that the road going into this campground was gonna be. It's I should have should have known. I travel around without a care, don't take my problems anywhere. Listen. Okay, new plan. We're just going for it. We're not even going to check it out. Yeah. So, oh, here we go, guys. If we can do it, you can probably do it too. It says bear in area. What? Bears in area. I 
don't know if I'm more afraid right now of this hill that we're climbing or the bears that are in the area. <laughs> This is actually a little shallower than the road. Yeah, but this isn't the, this isn't the worst part, I don't think. I don't think so either. Oh, oh see? Here it comes. Now I dream up in the clouds. I hope my feet don't fail me now. Ooh, ooh, ooh. If you need me to get out. I don't. I'm just getting get it nice and wide here. I'm, to, I'm sorry, I'm trying to be. I'm trying. Son of a gun, you got to do that. We don't want to do that because we, we drag. Yeah, but how steep is this going to be? Nine degrees, 10 degrees, 11 degrees. Shut your face. <laughs> Shut up. Back to 10. Oh. Oh gosh, do you see how close we are here, right? Yep. Okay. I think that was the hard part. I do too, but I just I feel like I want to cry because it's so stressed me. You're doing so great and I'm trying really hard. I think we made I think this I think the worst of it's done. Oh no, we still could wait. Yeah, up here. Are you sure we don't have to go up there yet? Oh we do, but we go down here and turn around. Oh, we're going up. Right there. Oh, what a view. I can't even look at the view right now. <laughs> I can't not. So we do like a loop-de-loop? -loop? Yeah, we go all the way down there, and take it all the way around. All right, look at this place. Guys, this is so cool. I think so far it's been worth the almost heart attack I just had. <laughs> this is gonna be a sharp turn here. I'll go way out of the Do you, I can get out at any time that you want me to get out. Uh, let's get out and watch our, tra our trailer okay. swing here. Okay, so trailer swing. Which way? This that way. On that side? Yeah. Okay. Here. Okay, go ahead. Yeah, I'm mainly concerned up here as I make this sharp turn. It's been good, so far. The funny is I'm back here, so do what you gotta do. All right, we're good if you like about. Okay, come in. There's more room back there than, than up here. I figured I just wanted to be safe. Oh, of course. Oh, of course. Hands down. You sure you don't be still back there? You yeah. Sure? Oh, yeah. I was making sure we clear those rocks there. Wowzers. Look at that. This might be the best view yet. A 376 would have a hard time with us. Yeah, because it's so low and it bottomed yeah. out. Because it's blue sky, blue sky, blue sky. This one here? Yep. Oh, thank you. Blue sky, blue sky, blue sky. Oh, look at this patio. Nice. Oh, it feels like the so cool. Oh, it feels like the summer to me. It feels like the summer. It feels like the summer and it's where I want to be. Okay, I think you're good. Swimming in the light of the warmer weather. You handled it like a boss, unlike me. <laughs> <laughs> I was scared, not gonna lie. Good job, baby. You too. And it feels like the summer. Oh, it feels like the summer to me. It feels like the summer. It feels like the summer, and it's where I want to be. We just got parked in Mama Gertie's. Look, look at that view. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I don't think I'm leaving. I know a lot of people clean everything and wipe all the counters down and do all that before leaving for traveling. And I actually do it the opposite way because I know from experience that whenever I would clean everything and then we would travel, especially two days of travel, I'd come back and I'd have to do it all over again because, you know, stuff gets rattled and it gets a little bit dirty. And we were at the beach, so we have a lot of sand and stuff still 
knocking loose. So since we had a short travel day, I'm gonna do a little bit more of a thorough cleaning before I get everything set up, because it needs it. When you're setting the RV up and your AirPod falls in the garbage. So now I gotta look through the garbage to find the other AirPod. Oh my gosh. Okay, I finally found it at the very bottom of the bag, of course. It's Monday. This place cleared out quite a bit. We're not quite in season season yet, but I have a feeling this place will pack it in. They have Cubert and Pitfall. <laughs> I have Asheville Retro Arcade. Is, is the Pinball Museum the same thing? It looks like it. Yeah, this is it. It's the same thing, right? I think so. So if you couldn't figure out by that little exchange, we're going to a retro arcade in Asheville. I have been super excited about going to this place for a long yes. time. And it's not a very nice day out, so it's also, a good day to do it. Might as well stay inside and play video games. Asheville Retrocade. But is this the same thing? I'm so confused. Just hold on. We're going to figure this out. And then <laughs> we're going to get right back to you. So we Turns out there's two. Yeah, what she said. <laughs> And there's a Retrocade and a Pinball Museum. It seems like they both have old school games and pinball. So we're just going to go to the Retrocade because I saw Tron. Yeah. <laughs> the Retrocade says that it's uh, 10 bucks per person, I think, obviously, per, for the whole day of playing. So that. And, That's uh, not bad. Yeah. Get that and a, a brew and got to get yourself a good afternoon. <laughs> So we found it, we parked right across the street in zone 16166. Uh, Uses the park mobile app, so that's kind of convenient. It's raining. It's raining, so, but not too hard, so we're just gonna book it across the street mm -hmm. and see what's what. Where? I don't know, it's not there. It must be over here. Oh, here we go. This is so old school. This is like one of the old arcades. <laughs> like the yeah. Oh, yeah, I love it. Yeah. Here's Terrace Kubert. Donkey Kong. jealous that I'm going to rescue this girl? Not really. <laughs> I used to have patterns for, for this game and so many others. Even, it's so dark though, it's hard to see. Tron. You've been wanting to play this one this whole time, right? Yeah. Do you remember how to play it? Uh-huh. It's like... <laughs> what was that? Can you do that again? <laughs> Go ahead. That was fun. <laughs> I was going to say, as I predicted, I sucked. But... That was awesome. Yeah, I'm not, I, don't, I don't remember all my patterns in Donkey Kong. Well, you know what I wish they had? I wish they had asteroids. Oh. 
because that was that was like the best game. I had that out at the beach. What was that? What was that line in Vacation? Like my dad had asteroids. <laughs> dad had asteroids. Yes. Yeah. You got asteroids? No, but my dad does. Can't even sit on the toilet some days. I really liked it. That was fun. We were what we were there for maybe a couple hours, I think. It was is very noisy, so just know that going into it if you're and yes. and I don't handle noise well, but I did okay in there because it wasn't very crowded. I was hoping they would play like cool eighties music. It said eighties music, but it was like ah. Well, that's very, okay. Very it was chaotic. fun. It was yeah. fun. We're gonna find this place called White Duck Taco Shop that his girls every time they come to Asheville they eat there and they love it. We've never been. There's one like a mile and a half away. Three point three miles, ten minutes. Oh. You got what? I got steak and cheese and like a bang bang shrimp. Mm. And I got mole duck and the Thai peanuts. Fresh watermelon with mint. A little bit of a cloudy day, but not... at least it stopped raining, huh? Mm hmm. I don't know if we if we even made an acknowledgement of your Atari shirt for the for the retro arcade. <laughs> Looks like there's some sunshine over there. There's no precipitation on the radar, so we're gonna we're gonna give it a shot. Yeah, we are gonna hit a section of the Blue Ridge Parkway we've never been on before. We're gonna make a stop at Craggy Gardens and Mount Mitchell, the highest peak east of the Mississippi, and then Little Switzerland. Yeah, I think we can see Mount Mitchell from the parkway. I don't think we can get to you it. You can go all the way to the top. Oh, really? It's paved all the way there. Wow, well, let's check that out then. Yeah. share the rest of our awesome ride where we make it to the top of Mount Mitchell and see some awesome views. We also visit a really cool retro RV park.